Hi, I'm Tim Love, co-host of the new show, Restaurant Startup on CNBC with today's grilling tip. Okay, when you talk grilling, you gotta have burgers. So right here, I'm gonna show you a couple great things you need to know when you're cooking burgers. First, I like to use a different blend than my burgers. It's half brisket and half tenderloin chain, but you can use anything you want. Just make sure you got about 20% fat in the meat. It makes it important. Always season burgers, just simply a little bit of salt and pepper. And if you like it a little bit spicy, put some chili powder in there. It's also kind of fun. I'll put these on just like this. Now, if you like your burgers well done, here's a good tip for you. Put yourself about a teaspoon of mayonnaise per half pound of burger, and then mash it in there like this. It's a good thing for your kids to do. You get your hands dirty like this. And then, while you're doing that, go ahead and season it with a little bit of salt and pepper. Go ahead and season in there. It's like this. And then make your patty. Now, you can make a nice half inch thick burger like this, or some small ones like I have on the grill. But you can cook it well done, keeps it really, really moist. Just like so. Now, once the burger sweats, it means it gets a little juice coming to the top, that's when it's time to flip. And when you flip it, add the cheese. I like to use American cheese, because I'm an American. Then we're gonna toast our bun. You don't want to toast on the top rack, you want to toast on the grill. You get a nice toasty bun that's gonna get it crisp, so your burger doesn't get real pink and all marbly in the. Now this one's sweating, we're gonna flip it. Same here, add our cheese, just like so. See, nice and toasty, very important. Now, this is where it gets really tricky. I'm gonna pull these burgers off. This one's ready. And I'm gonna show you the way you wanna build this. You're gonna start with sauce on the bottom. We call this the love sauce. It's important, it holds everything in place. Then the lettuce. Then the pickles, just like so. And then tomatoes. Then your burger goes on top. Now, before I put the lid on, we got one more special treat. Look at that burger, it's beautiful. I like to do something a little funky with my eggs. Put them on my burger. So we got a nice little quail egg, just a little Tim Love touch. Little baby egg. Little oil on your plancha. Oh yeah. Just get that nice and sunny side up. If you can't find a regular quail egg, you can go ahead and use regular eggs. Small eggs would be good. A little salt and pepper on your egg. This is gonna round out the entire burger. Just a little bit of yolk on it. There we go. And now, the top. That, my friends, is Tim Love Burger. Join me on Tuesdays for my new show, Restaurant Startup, at 10 p.m. Eastern on CNBC.